Hello and welcome back to another video. This is a walk to show directions from Kmart Domino's Subway in Innisfail, Queensland, Australia on the at, at 7.15 a.m. on Thursday the 24th of February 2022. So if you you go to Kmart, you come out and head towards the highway, you'll find Subway, and then turn around and you'll find uh, Domino's Pizza. Head down where you see the big McDonald's sign. So we're heading to show you where the bus stop is, where Coles is, and all that where you'll find the um, bus stop which will take you to Cairns, Townsville, places like that. And you'll find, point out where KFC is and a few other different places along the way. So it's easy for you to find directions. You can watch this video as you walk along safely. Uh, maybe put headphones in and listen to it, because I'll describe a lot of things. So keep going along and you'll find McDonald's, as you can see, or here. Just keep going past McDonald's if you're heading to the bus stop. Heading down here, have a look at the nice, nice flowers. You've got a map of the Innisfail area and some of the businesses. Some of these businesses don't exist anymore, like Sippy's Bakehouse is closed down. Perry's Cake Shop, you'll see the outside of that in my Rankin Street video, the Innisfail playlist. And then you've got the BP service station, which is 24 hours, which is great food, hot food, cold food, uh, soft drink, all your different lollies and chips and you know, different grocery things and all that. And you've got the Crown Hotel across the way which is being newly renovated. So we're coming across to, you be very careful here too, people like to cut you off though. They'll see that you've got the right of way and they'll cut you off from any of these here. So you've got to be very, very careful. And then they'll, they'll yell at you and everything. So be careful. A bit of a look around, showing what it's like. If you've never been here before, of course, just press on these to show that you're here and wait for the green little man. Straight forward. Sometimes it takes a while, but you got the Crown Hotel across there. Like I said, newly renovated. You got Harvey Norman up the way. I'll show that along the way. Then get a bit of an idea of where it is, where things are. That way you can go to Woolworths. And this whole food emporium has got Woolworths. It's got a hairdresser. It's got Brumbies. It's got a disability service, it's got the reject shop, it's got an Asian restaurant, takeaway on that, a jeweler, a massage place, no it doesn't have the massage place anymore, but it has the, uh, a nail salon, yeah, nail salon, and it's also got the Lifeline store, so if you want to head down there, you just go down that direction, down Lily Street, Till you see the Woolworths and Reject Shop sign. Oh, there's also a medical centre and um, pathology and different places like that in there as well. So it's basically a one-stop place. So we've got the little green man on there now. Let's go. Then we've got the Bedrock Cafe up here we'll see what times they're open just for people to see yeah start liquor across the way drive through bedrock cafe is very popular the opening hours are sunday monday tuesday wednesday saturday 10 a.m to 7 p.m ah monday ah sorry sunday monday tuesday 10 a.m to 7 p.m wednesday to saturday 10 a.m till 7 30 p.m there you go 
gives you a bit of an idea. Then you've got Tropic cartridges and printing, that's where you're printing. Um, printer cartridges, getting things faxed, getting things printed out, photocopied, all that sort of stuff. Very nice place. It used to be Cartridge World. You got the aquarium and bird center across the way. And the spice shop with Asian groceries, the great flavor of India. Here's your Here's uh, St. Vincent de Paul, Vinny's. Thrift shop. You got Innisfail food station. Harvey Norman for electrical appliances, phones, phone cables, all that sort of stuff. Fridges, freezers, washing machines, kitchen appliances, camera stuff, headphones, storage solutions. Oh, so many different things in there. Have a look on their website to see what they have in this room, this nightclub. Coming up on some empty shops. You just keep walking past this big vibe sign. You got Ron and Dean's Butchery across the road. And then you've got Hungry Jacks. Now for Americans, it's our version of Burger King. Same company, different name. So it's basically Burger King, home of the Whopper. Look in here where it used to be um, Ernest Street News back in the day. Then you got dog grooming place. And this is Bunnings, which used to be Hastings Deering. And it was a wine warehouse, and it was the warehouse, where the warehouse was a discount chain. And then it was Sands Warehouse, which is basically the same, same thing, different name. And now it's Bunnings, which is a hardware store, sort of like Home, Home Depot that the Americans have. And here we go, we're not too far away from the bus stop now. Just around the corner and up a little bit, you'll come across two bus stops and a toilet block. Be careful with the toilet block because it's sometimes very smelly. You got Coal Supermarket across the, across the road there, and that's heading up towards the main part of town, Edith Street. If you want to head up to the post office, different places, you'll see other videos in my NSFL playlist on Best of Times Reborn YouTube page, and lots of photos on old and new NSFL photos on Facebook. Now it's the and as in the end symbol for the Facebook one that looks like an eight. When you're searching for it, this is walk on wheels or your disability mobility machines and devices, walking frames, your uh, mobility scooters and all that type of stuff. And you got Chemex, which is like pool cleaning stuff, supplies and that, as you can read on there. Now we're coming up on your bus stop across the road is the bus stop that's the townsville direction so if you're going to townsville that's the direction that's the side you want to be on there where it says anzac memorial park you get that big tree and that's often where you'll get off the bus too this side where it says edith street up there this is where you would go to go to cairns so you would stop here if you're looking for the information caravan will go up a little bit further there's your bunnings an entry to bunnings bunnings warehouse it's all hardware and stuff like that um and you'd be going there's the information vans across here you can see it there with the big eye on it the caravan there and then if you want to get to kfc you just go straight down here and you'll see the big bucket there's a four-wheel drive shop next to it just down from there, on the next block, you've got super cheap auto. Across from there, you've got a pie shop. You've got a lawyer, a Kayla Lawyers. You've got two cafes and a tattoo place. They're on the opposite side of the road. Where you can see it's white, blue, and green. The blue roof, uh, green roof, sorry. Across there. And if you're heading down this way, if you go straight down this street which is Gladys Street you can get to Kmart that direction as well there's also the Black Marlin Motel and Burson Auto Parts 
if you go this direction, you follow it all the way down and then turn left, you'll get to Warina Lakes. You can also take the next street down, Charles Street. It'll take you directly to there, to Warina Lakes, which is a really nice place. You have a look at it on my playlist, Inisfail playlist. And if you need to find Centrelink, go down Gladys Street, down this way, past the electric um, thingies, the electric cars and that for charging, past BCFs down there too, boating, camping, fishing. And when you get to the corner of Grace Street and Gladys Street, turn right and go up and you'll see Centrelink on your left. You just keep going up here for KFC. And you've got the four-wheel drive place as well. And this is a historic building here. This was to do with the sepoys. S-W-E, second word, P-O-Y-S. Yeah, sepoys. They owned a lot of places in town. You can Google their name and you'll find it. Find stuff about them. Sepoys in as well. A lot of history there. That was their house for many years. Used to be a service station next to it. And there's car dealership. And it's Vale Mazda. And Nissan and such. Used to be Holden. Of course Holden's closed down in Australia. Okay, so we're, this is KFC. We're coming up on KFC. This is where we'll end the video shortly. We'll just show KFC for historical purposes for people to be able to look back and see where it was. If you want to follow this guide of where to go around, to get around, let me know what you think in the comment section and all that. If it helped you find your way around town or around um, this part or wherever you, you wanted to go, let me know if there's anywhere else you'd like to see directions to. Within the inn as well, easy, easy to get out walking distance. You've got a second hand dealer down there and a mower place. Thank you, power equipment. There's your, where you get your phone fixed and your computer fixed. That's across from KFC. And then, got in as well, backpackers. And back towards Coles. Thanks for watching. This is Bestest Times, keeping memories alive.